Hello. Hi. We're pretty close together we today. Are. Absolutely. Well, we've had, we've had to move, haven't we? We're, we have. We have a very full house today, don't absolutely. we? Absolutely. We're at Helen's and um, yeah. my mum's staying, so she's in one of the rooms. And then the administrator yep. who comes in to do all our office yep. work, she's in another room. So we've come into my upstairs study today. So with the, the sofa's a little bit small. It's a bit, it's a bit smaller for us, isn't it? We're feeling yeah, like we're, yeah. we're really close together. Absolutely. But that's all right, isn't it? It is. It's, it's fine. Good, we're all right good. now. And we're both fit and well. Yeah, we? I think so. Nice yeah, all is good. Yeah, absolutely. And I wonder, what have you been doing about harvest? Have you done lots of harvest Oh, festivals? yes. Lovely. Do love a good harvest. Absolutely Andy. adore a good harvest. I love In fact, I've just made Anne some soups with some squashes that I got from one of my harvest festivals because we've been saying lots of thank yous for all Absolutely. the wonderful gifts around us at the moment. And there are so we? many, aren't they? Yeah, I've got bags of apples. Oh, <gasps> love, love, love apple. Uh, we apple. had apple crumble last <gasps> night. Mm. Oh, I should have come yesterday. Yeah, it should have done. Uh, apple so, crumble. Yeah, so we're going to do some, we're going to have a story going to have wonderful story the bigger barn story it's one of our favorites we yeah. have done it before but we do love it we yeah. can't help it yeah, and we, we love the pictures yeah. as well okay so it is a great great story yeah, absolutely about harvest and we've got a song about fluffy cabbages i think cauliflowers fluffy for those of you who are doing harvest festivals with me you'll be singing that with me so Anne and i are going to attempt to sing it together i'm not very familiar with it so helen's going to teach me so we can be guaranteed the wrong words. Yes, because I always sing the wrong words. Anne will sing the right words, but I'll keep her to tune. So we're a good That's team. Awesome. Absolutely. Aren't we? Um, and we're going to do a craft. And we're going to do we a are. craft. I collected some leaves, didn't we? So I Anne was some. asked, she went out and, and got some leaves, but also some, some flower heads and things. And we're going to yeah. uh, have some fun with those, aren't Absolutely. we? Absolutely. Paint. And I've got the paint. Absolutely. So should we go and do that? Let's do our craft. Okay. Well, here we are. We've got some... Lovely paints. You've chosen some lovely autumn colours. Well, I thought we had these from last week. Do you remember last time when we did um, World Peace Day? Oh, yes, we were doing the dark. Yeah. And I thought I would use these paints because we know we had them. And they are autumnal colours, aren't yeah, they? Oranges and yellows. And and, uh, yeah. Yes. So I picked some leaves from the garden. Any other leaves? I love this one. This is actually Virginia Creeper. And look, it goes this beautiful red in any case. But there we are. Um, I've got some other ones. This I might the... paint it red, Anne. Yep. Yeah. I've got some Budlia with the nice sea head See, Anne knows it. all the names, everybody. No, I, don't, I, don't. I don't. And I pulled a bit of ivy off the wall. There we are. So all sorts of leaves. Just find any leaf that's got a nice pattern. This is um, a hydrangea. And, oh, this was my fig. And look fig what else Anne got. Oh, you yeah. want to know what that is, everyone? That's a, that's a dead sunflower head, isn't yep. it, with all the seeds in. Yep. But what we're going to do is we're going to print things using... Yep. flowers and leaves the sorts of things you see in autumn aren't we yeah and seeing what sort of pictures we make so um i'll leave that one there for now because that one might look this really one. lovely in um, yellow so okay here we go choose a leaf i will choose i'm going to try one of your what were these virginia creeper virginia creeper and i'm going to go red on that okay one. okay um we've got you can try putting your leaf straight onto the paint or uh, we've got some little toweling. A bit like sort of on washable cotton wool yep. pads. You could use brushes or you could use kitchen, kitchen roll time. even. Yep. But um, just... We're going to use these little pads because we thought otherwise we might get too much paint on them. I'm going to get loads of paint on my hands, I know, today. But oh, I don't mind getting a bit So messy. paint the leaf. And like that? that? Yeah, and I'm going to put a bit, I'm going to make it, there we are, do two colours. Oh, trust Anne, she well, always does two colours, doesn't she? There we go. Well, I'm going yep. Virginia Creeper Red there. And there we are. And then I turn it upside, upside down, down and, and press. Yep. Now, for some of the more delicate leaves, I guess you've got to press quite yep. quite carefully. And don't do it with a, a painty hand, because you know what I'm like for getting paint everywhere. And then yep. lift. And lift. Wow. And yours is better than mine, you see. Look. Doesn't that look nice? Yes. I'm getting very excited now. What am I going to do next? I'm going to leave that there. I'm going to do, you had a buddlier head there, didn't you? Yeah. Is that buddlier? That's a buddlier head. There right, we are. I'm just going to. Do you know what I'm going to do on this one? No, I'm not. I was going to dip it in, but I'm not going to. Because you know what will happen. I'll have so much paint, I won't be able to see what's going on. So I'm going to put some green paint on the just the flower i'm going to do Anne. okay i'm just going to do the flower you're doing another is that I was trying, to, uh, not trying not trying to do it that's a 
That was the fig leaf. Oh, the <laughs> fig leaf. <laughs> Actually, the fig leaf. Ah, right. So that's my uh, green. I'm going to turn that over. And I'm just going to... Again, because you want the definition and you want to see what the flowers look like when they're printed, you don't want to press too hard. Do you? Does that look like a buddler? Is that a no, buddler? Buddly, no. I might, uh, I might go next to it again. But you can get some wonderful textures, yep. can't you, from these plants? I'm not going to press too hard, Anne. <laughs> yeah. It's a nice texture. It doesn't look much like a buddleia, does it? No, I think it's quite difficult. Shall I it? paint the sunflower yellow and go see on. what happens? See what happens. Or shall I just... Oh, look. Look what's coming off the sunflower All the already. seeds. All the seeds, which you get from sunflowers, don't you? Shall I just... Shall you, I? You just want to do that, don't I you? I do. I'm desperate to do it. I'm going to go for it. I'm I think that's all the yellow it. paint gone now. Or well, you've got a bit more if you need some. There you go. What do you think about that? Yep. I'm going to try your green. Don't try yellow. Right. Oh, I don't know. Maybe some more yellow paint. More, more yellow paint. Hang on, let me find. Have we got yellow? some more yellow paint? Yellow. Maybe just squirt some on there, and I'll whiz it around a little bit. Try and so that's it. Lovely. <laughs> Perfect. Right. Oh look. Use my fingers. This is definitely messy church, isn't it? This is good. Could you imagine if we were doing this in church? Maybe when we do start meeting again, we can. Um, we can do some really we messy stuff. We can do some really messy stuff. Right, now I've no idea what this is going to look like. Probably. It's a bit soggy because don't forget it's been raining out there, hasn't it? So yes, I, I did dry it, but it didn't, I probably didn't dry it for long are... enough. <gasps> oh, you got oh, the seeds stuck to it. I got seeds stuck in there. I think, I know you liked my Virginia creeper, but I think my painting's gone downhill since then, Anne, don't you? Go yeah. on, you can say yes. Well, I mean, what you can do with the leaves, of course, that's not very good either, is actually you can do a collage even. of leaves just by putting them on and sticking them to the paint. Do you know, one of the other things we did think about doing, but changed our mind, and that would be vegetable halves, because we didn't want to waste the vegetables, did we? No. But that would be really, um, you could really see the vegetables from uh, from the shapes of them, couldn't you? There we go. I think, oh, see, I'm, I'm not... Uh, Mine aren't very good now. I'm going to try another um, ivy leaf. But I think you have to look at Anne's and see how it should be done today. Oh, well, I don't I don't know that. I'm just trying to also using some of the paint just to actually stick some. Yeah. So sort of a... Oh, you're putting um, leaves on. Oh, yeah. You're actually going to stick some leaves oh, there we are. on. What's that one, Anne? Oh, oh, that's a buddleia again. I've done um, the buddleia. There's a bit of bamboo, bit of bamboo leaf. What can you do with bamboo, do you think? Oh, no. Let me go for red. You, you do like the red, red, don't you? I love red, but it's such an autumnal colour, isn't it? Look at Anne's picture. Anne's picture looks really lovely and autumnal with her. Mind you, mine does as well, colour-wise, but you've gone red and yellow on some of yours, which gives it that lovely... I think I've run out of yellow, but I'm just going to... Get a little bit of yellow off the plate. You're a bit Thank messy, you. I am a bit messy. I'm just going to find some kitchen. Actually. I might let Anne wash her hands in a minute. Well, actually, one of us has to turn the pages on the book today, so we're going to have <laughs> to wash our hands, I think. Because I don't think we? it ought to be me looking at the state of my hands. No, well, I haven't shown you mine yet. Right, then, this is my last one. That oh, looks good, isn't it? But choose some oh. leaves, have some fun. Make some yeah, pictures. You can do whatever you want to. You oh, yeah. really can. And a mixture, a collage of, of both painted leaves and then real leaves stuck on. And maybe use paint brushes or cotton wool because, as you can see, my hands are as painted as my picture. Anyway, there we are. Wonderful. Make yourself awesome. an autumn awesome. harvest collage. Absolutely. Well done. Right then. Should we wash our hands, Anne? Yeah, I think so. And so this is our story of the rich farmer. Here is a farmer who is very rich. The farmer is rich because his soil is rich and his corn grows faster than anyone else's and higher than anyone else's. And at harvest time, he has much more of it than anyone else. Lucky man. This year, he has so much corn that his old barn can't hold it all. It is bursting at the seams. 
No problem, says the farmer. I will pull it down and build a bigger one. Then next year I will be rich enough to take life easy. So he builds a bigger barn. But when harvest comes round again, the new barn is not big enough. The greedy farmer has planted more corn than before and carrots too. No problem, says the farmer. I will build an even bigger, better barn. Then next year I will be richer still and then I can really enjoy myself. So he builds a bigger, better barn. But at harvest time, even the bigger, better barn is not big enough. Again, the farmer has planted too much corn, too many carrots and a few cabbages as well. This time the farmer says to himself, I will build the biggest, grandest barn the world has ever seen. And then I shall be so rich, I never need to work again. The barn he builds reaches up to the sky. When it is finished, the farmer sighs a big, great, big sigh. <sighs> Tomorrow I will gather in the harvest and then at last I shall begin to enjoy myself. I know, I'll have a party. Oh, but that very night he dies in his sleep, just like that. The birds eat his corn, the rabbits dig up his carrots and his cabbages go to seed. The big barn stands empty and the rich farmer never does get to enjoy his money. Poor man. Jesus says, How silly it is for a man to spend his whole life storing up riches for himself. To God, he really is a poor man. I do love that story. Do you know, it is one of my favourites. It does make you think, doesn't yeah, it? Yeah, absolutely. How much stuff can we collect in our lifetime? Absolutely. And what's the point? Yes, absolutely. And just hanging on to things and trying to strive for even more and not enjoy what you have. I mean, that was the problem, wasn't it? He just wanted more and more and didn't get to enjoy any of it. And, you know, it did make me think, you know, when we go to our harvest festivals and we see all that amazing food that people have given us because they've got too much of it. Yeah. And there's so much of it that if you share it and let other people enjoy it, yeah. then that's so much better. Because what happens if you try and save too many vegetables at home? They just go off. Don't Absolutely. They? And also, you just don't know what happens tomorrow. So, yeah, it's a very good story and a very good story about how we ought to share and Food Bank, as always, is Absolutely. a really good way of sharing Absolutely. all the wonderful food we have. Absolutely. So you never know, maybe we can do it again yeah. next year. Absolutely. I wonderful love it. story. Great. So, we're going to have some... No, we're not. I always forget the song, don't we're I? We're going to sing the song about we're going to sing fluffy about all cauliflowers. Wonderful vegetables. Absolutely. Yes. Wonderful. Fluffy cauliflowers. So, song time, and we did say we were going to sing Cauliflower's Fluffy. Now, we this did. is a new one to Anne. To yep. be fair, we sing it a lot in our schools, but you you don't know. Well, it I think so I probably well. do, I probably have somewhere in the deep and distant past, but I've forgotten it altogether. Okay. So, what's going to happen is I'm going to try and keep Anne to tune because it is quite a fast tune. You'll know that if you've sung it. But you know what I'm like you're forgetting the wrong words. So, listen to Anne's words, but my tune if any of that makes sense. Are or you just, ready? Or just sing louder than we do. Cause Good be idea. Better. Drown us out, is that what you're saying? Absolutely. <laughs> right then, everybody, let's sing Cauliflower's Fluffy. Cauliflower's fluffy and cabbages green. Strawberries sweeter than ever I've seen. Beetroot purple and onions white All grow steadily day and night The apples are ripe, the plums are red The broad beans are sleeping in their blankety bed Blackberries juicy and rhubarb sour Marrows fattening hour by hour Gooseberries hairy and lettuces fat Radishes round and runner beans flat The apples are ripe, the plums are red The broad beans are sleeping in their blankety bed 
Orangey carrots and turnips cream. Redling tomatoes that used to be green. Brown potatoes in little heaps. Down in the darkness where the celery sleeps. The apples are red, the plums are red. The broad beans are sleeping in their blankety bed. Yeah! <laughs> when I was at school doing a harvest festival last week, they all remembered the yeah. And I missed it, but I got it this time. We did all right. Yeah. We did all right. The bit that I couldn't get in time was the blackberries are sour, juicy, and rhubarb sour. I get that line all blah, 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 muddled up. I've got my apples are red. I've got the apples were yeah. right. Apples are right, not red. But what's yeah. red? The plums, plums are, are red. red. They are, aren't they? I love plums this time of year. Mm. My favourite fruit at this time yeah. of year. Absolutely. Me too. Yeah. So, right. so we've done a craft. We've had a story. We've sung a song. Let's say some prayers. prayers. Big Thanksgiving prayers, I guess. Absolutely. Shall yeah. we pray today? Yeah, that'd be good. As Anne told us that wonderful story mm. that we do love. So let's just pray. Creator God, we give you thanks for all the wonderful harvest gifts that we have at this time of year. For all the things that we find on our plates and in the shops. And we also give you thanks for generous people who ensure that our food banks are full of lots of nice things. And we'll end our prayers with a really big Amen. There we are, everybody. Absolutely. There we are. Now, I think towards the end of um, October, we're going to do All Saints. Right? Absolutely. We're going to... Comes about the round about the time of Halloween, so I don't know what we'll do for that, but we'll have well, some fun. We'll talk, we? Maybe we'll talk about All Saints and the fact that it forms that festival of All Hallows. All Hallows. All if Hallows. You watch Harry Potter, you'll know what All Hallows is. All Hallows and where we get Halloween from. Yeah. The Eve of yeah. All Hallows Festival. So that will be what we're doing next time. We will. Yes. Anyway, have a lovely time. Bye. Look after yourselves. Bye, everyone. Bye.